Hello friends. In today video we are going to talk about wireless hacking OS called Wi-Fi Slacks. In this video I show you how to install it in VMware. Wi-Fi Slacks is a Slackware GNU Linux distribution. It designed for wireless hacking and forensics. Wi-Fi Slacks includes a long list of security and audit tools for wireless networking. It has a great integration of several unofficial network drivers in the Linux kernel, thus giving immediate support for a large number of wired and wireless network cards. Open VMware Workstation and select Create a new virtual machine. Select Browse Wi-Fi Slacks ISO image and select the image you have downloaded from the Wi-Fi Slacks website. I shall also give the link of Wi-Fi Slacks official website in the video description from where you can download latest ISO image of Wi-Fi Slacks. Now choose Linux in the guest operating system and select version Ubuntu 64 and click on Next. This operating system required minimum 10 GB of space. Choose your desired hard disk space and select virtual disk into multiple files and click on next. Now click on custom hardware setting and change virtual machine settings according to your computer hardware specifications. So here's the virtual machine is ready. So let's run it now. So here's the boot. Here's the whole thing in Spanish. So first we change the keyboard language to English. Now we change the language of this operating system to English. The booting process is underway. The Wi-Fi Slacks is starting now. Wi-Fi Slacks has started. Now we will install it in our virtual machine. And the process is also same for hard disk. First we adjust our display settings according to our screen. First go to start. Then select system and then select install Wi-Fi Slex and then Wi-Fi Slex installer. Now this is telling us to create a partition in our hard disk. So now we open G part here and select create partition table. After that leave the partition table type MS DOS and click on apply. The partition table has been created. Now we will create a partition here for this we will select new option and I use whole space of 15 gigabytes and then click on add button. Primary partition has created. Now close all the tabs and the installation process has been started.
Installation process has started now. It will take some time. Now it will install the grub bootloader. So here we get two options. Where you have to install the grub bootloader in MBR or root. So I select the default option. Now we restart this OS and will boot this from virtual hard drive. You will find many tools here for wireless Wi-Fi cracking. Hope you like this video. Please subscribe my channel and hit the bell icon for latest videos.